Hey, it's Bill Roscoe at the Boise Rescue Mission down here at the River of Life Shelter at River Street and 13th in Boise, where today over 100 people are going to be tested to see if they have the COVID-19 antibody or perhaps have the COVID virus. I want to say a big thank you to Salser Health and Crush the Curve Idaho for paying it forward uh, with this project here today, checking homeless people out, making homeless people able to have tests to see if they have the antibody. This is just a wonderful way for the business community and the medical community and the people of the community to all be served and we really appreciate it. So this is the piece of equipment that we're talking about. Yeah, that's, that's a fire alarm, you know, and that's as far as I go with it. Well, come to find out this piece of equipment is worth over $20,000. This is a really big deal because if there's a fire in the building, not only does that ring the alarm here, but it also rings at the fire department and that's critical because of the numbers of people we shelter here. And when I found out that it was down this week, I realized that it wasn't in the budget and I was thinking, how are we gonna pay for that? And it's Tommy Alquist. And he said, Bill, I'm paying it forward and I wanna know what I could do for the rescue mission. Do you have anything big? And I said, yes, I do, as a matter of fact. And I told him about this project and I told him the price tag on it. And right away, quick, he said, we can do that. And soon we're gonna be fire safe again. So I just have to once again say, Tommy, thank you. Thank you, Paul Ventures Alquist. Thank you for being a leader in the community in terms of philanthropy. There's no one out in front of Tommy Alquist in this valley, and we really appreciate his friendship and support. First of all, I wanna thank Chris Roth for uh, challenging me in the pay it forward challenge. Chris is the CEO of St. Luke's Health System and they are doing incredible work here in the Valley, but not just here, all around the state. Uh, St. Luke's has tested about 85% of the people in the state. Uh, they're responsible for caring for our sickest people in our ERs and our ICUs, and they've done just a tremendous job. So thank you, Chris, for the challenge. Thank you for all you're doing. We paid it forward today down here at the Boise Rescue Mission. Reverend Bill Roscoe and the Boise Rescue Mission does incredible work all the time, 365 days a year, helping our most vulnerable. They truly are the safety net for this entire region and we're thankful for them and for all that they do. So we're able to come and help them out and pay it forward and we're, we're just so pleased to be able to do that. As you know, the way this challenge works is at the end of our challenge, when we pay it forward, we challenge others to pay it forward as well. And the three people I've chosen are Governor Brad Little, the CEO of KTVB, Kate Morris, and the CEO of Idaho Central Credit Union, Kent Orem. Can't wait to see what you guys do to pay it forward and help our community. Thank you.